Hello my lovely students. Today we are back with the continuation of the chapter food where does it come from? As earlier students we have discussed about plants as a source of food. So today we will discuss about animals as a source of food and categorization of animals. So let's start learners. So students, as we have discussed in our earlier video about sources of food. So sources of food is the place or the living organism from which we are obtaining our food. For example, the two main sources that we have discussed are plant sources and animal sources. Also students, we have discussed about different parts of the plant. As we have roots, we have stems, we have flowers, we have leaves and we can say we have seeds as well as you can see from the picture. This topic is already covered in the earlier video. Now we will continue our new topic. So students, in this we will discuss about the different types of food items which are obtained from animals are like we can obtain meat, chicken or we can obtain eggs from the hen and we can also obtain honey from the honeybees. So students, all these food items that are obtained from animals will come under the category as sources of food. As animal source foods include many food items that comes from an animal source. Which animal source we are talking here? Like meat, milk, eggs, cheese and yogurt. All these food items are those which we obtain from animals. See students, from the picture we can see that from animals we get meat, we get chicken, we get fish and even we get cheese from animals. So, the food items that are obtained from animals are chicken, milk and honey. So if I talk about all these food items, the main that we have is, what is the main food item that we have students? The main food item is milk why milk is the main food item because students from milk we obtain variety of milk products like we obtain curd ghee butter cheese etc second if i talk about honey honey is a sweet juice or material that is obtained from honeybees. Where does we obtain honey? We obtain honey from honeybees. Honeybees used to make honey from the nectar. Where does they used to make honey? They used to make honey from the nectar. So basically students, Honey is a thick liquid. As you can see from the picture, honey is a thick liquid that is amber or gold in color. As from the picture we see that honey is golden brown in color. It is produced by bees. Bees produce honey, right? And is created from nectar extracted from flowering plants. 
so that was the definition about honey so students what honey bee do is what does honey bee do as from the picture you can see honey bee is sitting on a flower right you can see this so honey bee sits on a flower of a plant and used to suck the sweet juice that is the nectar the sweet juice is nectar where does he suck that sweet juice he sucked that sweet juice from the flower then students inside in its body he used to modify it to make honey and finally and finally students honey stores honey in a particular house that is known as bee hives of the honey as you can see from the picture now comes the definition of nectar as you can see from the picture a honey bee is sitting on a flower as we have talked earlier honey bee sits on a flower and sucks the sweet juice from the flower and that sweet juice my dear students is known as nectar so nectar is defined as it is a liquid made by the flowers of a plants it is sweet because it has sugar in it so students honey is prepared by honey bees right and is then stored in bee hives and then only students it can be extracted from bee hives and then can be used by human beings now students the last topic that we can discuss in this chapter is categorization of animals as you can see from the screen in this we will divide different animals into three categories on the basis of their food habits that is what kind of material they are eating so on the basis of food habits of the animals we divide it into three categories those are first herbivores second carnivores third omnivores herbivores are those animals which eat only plants or plant products like grasses like cow deer goat or elephants next is carnivores carnivores are those animal students which eat animal or animal product like meat or flesh for example lion eat meat tiger eagle etc these are the examples of carnivores so students now we come to the last category that is omnivores omnivores are those animals or person that eats a variety of food of both plant as well as animals so students for example we the human beings eat both that is plants as well as animals so we come under the category of omnivores similarly bear pigs hens etc so students we have covered these three categories as herbivores carnivores and omnivores herbivores are which animal students herbivores are those animals that eat almost only plants and carnivores are those animals that eats almost only meat and the last omnivores are those animal that eats plants 
and me. Thank you, my dear students. So, students, this completes our chapter that is food. Where does it come from? So, students, we will meet again in another interesting video of a new chapter. Till then, take.